गुड मॉर्निंग एम एस सी फिजिक्स प्रीवियस इन प्रीवियस वीडियोज वी हैव डिस्कस्ड डिफरेंशियल एम्पलीफायर इट्स डी सी एंड ए सी एनालिसिस एंड कॉन्स्टेंट करेंट बायस टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस करेंट मिरर एंड लेवल ट्रांसलेटर सो वॉट इज अ करेंट मिरर करंट मिरर इज अ सर्किट इन विच आउटपुट करंट इज इक्वल टू द इनपुट करंट इन अदर वर्ड्स द आउटपुट करंट इज अ मिरर इमेज ऑफ द इनपुट करंट द करंट मिरर इज अ स्पेशल केस ऑफ कॉन्स्टेंट करंट बायस एंड देयर फोर इट कैन बी यूज टू सेट अप कॉन्स्टेंट एमीटर करेंट इन डिफरेंशियल एम्पलीफायर स्टेजेस The circuit diagram of current mirror is shown below. In this circuit, current I C three is equal to current I two, where I two is the input of this current mirror, and I C three is the output of this current mirror. I C three is the collector current of transistor Q three. Current mirror circuits are most commonly used in integrated amplifiers because of its simplicity and ease of fabrication. In this circuit, transistors Q three and Q four are identical. Hence, their base emitter voltages must be same, and also their base and collector currents must also be approximately equal. hence v b e 3 is equal to v b e 4 and i c 3 is equal to i c 4 also i b 3 is equal to i b 4 from the circuit we can see that current i 2 is equal to i c 4 plus i further current i is equal to i b 3 plus i b 4 Since the two transistors are identical, current I B three must be equal to current I B four. Hence, current I is equal to two I B four. Therefore, current I two is equal to I C four plus two I B four. We can write equations for these currents. I two is equal to I C four plus I, where I is equal to two I B four. So I two is equal to I C four plus two I B four. I B four is equal to I B three, and I C four is equal to I C three. So we can write I two is equal to I C three plus two I B three. I B three can be written as I C three divided by beta D C. Therefore, I two is equal to I C three one plus two by beta D C. We know that beta D C is generally very large. Therefore, two upon beta D C is very small, and hence I two can be written as I two is equal to I C three. the current i2 can be obtained by writing the kirchhoff's voltage equation for the base emitter loop of the transistor q3 and i2 is obtained as vee minus vve3 divided by r2 so i2 depends on resistance r2 and r2 can be chosen to set a desired value of collector current for satisfactory operation of the circuit it is necessary that two transistors should be identical now we will discuss what is level translator we know that differential amplifier is the basic building block 
of operational amplifier there are many stages in operational amplifier the first stage is dual input balanced output differential amplifier and the second stage is dual input unbalanced output differential amplifier this second stage is coupled directly to the first stage and we know that in direct coupling there is no bypass and coupling capacitors because of this direct coupling the dc level at the emitter rises from stages to stage hence level transistor circuit is needed to reduce this dc level to zero each amplifier stage produces ac amplification of the signal but at the same time the dc level is shifted due to the bias voltages this increase in dc level tends to shift the operating point of transistors of the succeeding stages and therefore limits the output voltage swing and even distort the output signal therefore level transistor circuits are used to shift the output dc level to zero level transistor circuits are also called as level shifters so level shifters are the circuits that shift the input voltage in order to compensate for dc offset voltages operation amplifiers have level shifters included in their design there are a variety of level transistor circuits an emitter follower with a voltage divider is the simplest among them the circuit diagram of this emitter follower circuit with voltage divider is shown here the positive dc voltage at the base of this transistor can produce 0 volt at the junction of r1 and r2 with proper selection of this these components in this way this circuit can produce 0 volt at the output with a positive dc voltage at the input better results can be obtained by using an emitter follower either with a diode constant current bias or a current mirror instead of the voltage divider the circuit diagram of these two circuits are shown below this is a circuit diagram of level transistor where r2 has been replaced by a diode constant current bias this provides better stability to the circuit and this is the circuit diagram of a level transistor where r2 has been replaced by a current mirror we can also use a zener constant current bias with emitter follower in forming a level transistor but a emitter follower current mirror level transistor is mostly used in operation amplifiers thank you